Good morning, afternoon, and evening from wherever you are watching from. Welcome to Belinda's Country Living. Today I will be making dark red kidney bean salad. So let's talk about what you're going to be needing to make this recipe. You're going to need two cans of dark kidney beans and these cans are 16 ounces. Now, I've got two different kinds, but they're both dark red. Now you can use any kind of bean to your liking. You can use the light brown, you can use dark kidney beans, you could use black beans, any kind of bean you wish to use in this salad. You're also going to need a half a cup of Miracle Whip. Now I use Miracle Whip because my opinion it does much better in salads than regular mayo but you use what you're used to using. I'm going to use a half of a, a medium onion. And I'm also going to use roughly to your taste. I'll know later, but this is all I have. So I'm saying maybe two to three tablespoons of sweet relish. You're also going to need two to three hard boiled eggs and two stalks of celery. Now these are small, so these are all in the ingredients and most of you have these ingredients already in your refrigerator. So let's get started. You also want to make sure that you drain your beans and rinse them very well. And I have already <coughs> drained and rinsed my kidney beans and set the stuff aside here so you can see what I'm doing. It usually takes around 10 minutes to prep all of this and then you want to refrigerate it for a couple hours to get it good and cold. This is a very simple yet very delicious old-fashioned bean salad. I can remember my mom always made bean salad, deviled eggs, when we went on a, a picnic. And boy is this onion strong. It's probably going to make me cry here in a minute. Hope you all are having a wonderful day today. I get a few hours off. I need to be back over at Wilma's at five o'clock getting better uh, between the three of us taking care of her let's chop this all up real super fine Wilma had another five day stay in the hospital just got her home uh, Friday evening she had another UTI and she wasn't eating. She wasn't taking any liquid in. At least not enough that I think she should. But it is what it is. She's 97. And she will be 98. August the 2nd. So we got that onions done here. And we're gonna chop up these two stalks of celery. Now I know most, a lot of you probably want to say, you know, take the strings out of these. Well, I don't because you won't notice them. You wanna take the strings out, just hop to it. All you have to do 
is grab a hold of the end like this and just pull them off just like that but I don't do it so there's no need and let's just chop this up real good but yeah Wilma is to my understanding they're saying that because of her age um, she, she'll always have UTIs. Well, what do you do? I can't keep taking her into emergency room and uh, every time she gets a UTI, but yet they won't give her any antibiotics to take. So I, I don't know. But I like to chop my celery up real fine. There you go. We got that done. Got her done. And just dump them in your your kidney beans. There we go. Set this aside. Let's go ahead and mix this up. Now, you know, if you want, you could add some shredded cheese to this. You could add some carrots. Mix all that up. Now, we're just, um, just going to eyeball this and give you a rough. So, uh, yeah, there's about two tablespoons. I have to put this on my grocery list. Okay, let's put in the half a cup. Of the uh, Miracle Whip. Whoop, slop that everywhere. I love bean salad, y'all. Now, what I like to do is just use my little grater here. It's quick and easy and just grate that, that egg right in there. <clears throat> just like that. You know, this side dish goes great with Um, hamburger sandwiches just the side dish now I'm gonna stir this up just to see if I need to use that other egg let's see oh yeah and you know what because I like eggs we're gonna go ahead and use three eggs here we go. I've been outdoors today. Uh, I mowed the lawn. And, you know, it's my allergies. No matter what I use, it doesn't help. Now, because I didn't have enough sweet relish, I'm going to add a little bit of pickled sweet pickle juice to that. Just a little bit of sweeten it up. Alrighty, and this really looks good, y'all. I got um, a box that was sitting on my porch yesterday from, um, the box says, Home Shopping Network. I have not ordered anything 
from Home Shopping. HSM, Home Shopping. I have not opened it because I don't know where it's from, but I plan on doing a video on that. I'm just curious, but, and that's what we have. We are done with this. It does taste better when it's chilled in the refrigerator for a few hours. So let's give it a taste. We may have to, you know, like most cooks, we always taste our food. And that way we know if we need to add. Wow, that's very good. I'm loving it. It will taste better, like I said, once it's in the refrigerator and chilled. So I'm gonna go ahead and put it in this dish, put a lid on it, and we are going to chill it and I'll be taking Wilma some of this over this evening. Hope y'all have a wonderful and blessed day. I want to thank each and every one of my subscribers. I love watching and looking at all of your comments. And I do try to respond. I haven't done a video in the last week or two. Oh, I know. Um, because I'm taking care of Wilma. If you're new to my channel, I want to welcome you to my YouTube family. And please give me that thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. And as always, remember to be kind in your word. And Jesus loves you. And so do I. Have a great and blessed day.